Thank you for tuning in to ORA TV. My name is Sanya, and joining me is Roba Galero from the Romo Green page. Hi, Roba. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for having me, Sanya. Um, I would like to ask you a few questions. Is that okay? Sure. Um, could you explain what the Romo Green page is? Sure. The Romo Green page is a directory that's created to promote unity and economic development, as well as to convene a guide to Oromo businesses in the Romo community. And what is on the Romo Green page? We'll have a list of businesses and success stories. And who would be an example of the success story? We'll have uh, people like Mike, uh, Mike Abeba, uh, Nick Slicke. Mike Abeba is a very successful uh, um, real estate business owner. And also um, Nick Slicke in an entertainment business. She has directed the movie uh, um, Faggers. And I think that was a very successful movie. Me personally, I, li I like that movie. So um, we've also been featuring a lot more uh, entrepreneurs of Romos. And let's say I have a business listed on the green page. How would it benefit me? It will benefit you because let's say, for example, you moved to, uh, from Portland to Minnesota and you wanted to find a restaurant in Minnesota and you don't know, and you don't know anybody out there. So what, would you, what you would do is if you look on the green page, you just look for a number, any or more businesses, you look for a lot of restaurants, you call them and talk to them. It's not only actually to, um, to actually do business with them, you can actually call them for business advice. Let's say you want to start your own restaurant, you can actually call them and ask them, how can, we, how can, how can I start my own restaurant? And not only that, but you can actually, let's say uh, you're an artist, let's say you're a Romo artist, and you don't have a lot of uh, retail stores that you have been distributing your music to. So what you could do is you can actually see a lot of retail stores that are listed in the green page. You can call them one by one, be able to do a business deal with them. So that way it will actually, it will be beneficial for the stores to create more revenue and also for artists to actually sell the records. How can an Oromo person submit their uh, business onto the Oromo Green page? Right now we have a website, uh, www.oromogreenpage.com. You can probably see it under your screen right there. Um, they can actually go to that website and go to the submission form, fill the information, and right when they submit it, we can receive it and uh, it'll be listed. But for them to actually submit and be listed on the 2007 Oromo Green page, they have to submit it before June 15. But they can still go ahead and submit at all times. But for them, in order to be uh, listed on a 2007 green page, it has to be uh, submitted by June 15. And when will the Oromo green page be distributed? Uh, the Oromo green page will be distributed uh, in the 2007 uh, summer time in uh, Minneapolis and the soccer tournament. At the same time, we'll uh, distribute the Oromo green page and also going to be if people that are not going to show up to the tournament or if for any reason they can't show up, they can actually order the Ormo Green Page online from the Ormo Green Page website also. And it will be in um, Ormo, Ormo communities nationwide and also will be in church, mosques, anywhere you can, where you can find it. And how often is it going to be published? Uh, it will be published every year for now, but in the future we're planning to uh, publish it frequently. So. Is the Oromo Green Page a local directory? Actually, Oromo Green Page is a national directory. Actually, not only national, it's a, a North America directory because the whole United States and Canada is included. In the future, we also plan to expand to worldwide. What is, what is the main goal for the Oromo Green Page? What are you trying to accomplish with the Oromo Green Page? Um, what we are trying to accomplish with Oromo Green Page is we are trying to have all the Oromo's network and uh, by networking, network is a very powerful thing. And uh, I hope every one of you can uh, network with one another. Let's share information. Sharing, inf sharing information can only improve us, not make us dumber. It can make us only stronger and smarter. So by actually uh, creating this Oromo network, we can actually become way more powerful than we are. And educational-wise, and in a lot of ways, we can actually uh, improve our own lives and also become much more successful. And hopefully also by um, having entrepreneurial stories on there, our intention is to actually motivate a lot of young people to actually start their own business and to get into uh, whatever kind of business that you actually wanted to. They, I want people to actually start their own business so they can become successful like, uh, like Mike.
So would you please tell our viewers what the website is one more time? Actually, the website is uh, www.oromogreenpage.com. Would you like to add anything else? Yes, actually, I would like to add one more thing. I would like to uh, uh, encourage all Oromo people to actually submit their business into uh, Oromo Green Page so we can publish it. And if you actually don't have an access to internet, go to the Oromo Community Center. I'm pretty sure uh, that's not hard to get a hold of. Call the Oromo Community Center and have them submit your business for you. And please don't take your time. Do it now. And uh, hopefully my success for all of us. Thank you. Thank you for joining me, Roba, and I hope to see you again. Thank you for having me, Sanya. This has been Oda TV. Thank you for watching.